What's up, Nords on the Renegade Cactus, but you can call me whatever you want. Welcome back. We are on Mount Fuji, if I remember correctly. Yes, yes. We might just be, and I have absolutely no idea what we were doing. I mean, I know we were here and all, but we were just walking through. We didn't rescue the people that was in Australia, right? We don't have a World Cup at the moment. We're just in Mount Fuji to see how things go. Let's see if we find anything else interesting. Sleek we already have, but hey, it's free training. Let's throw Dinkum out. Although I think I said I want to up Leafy even more just because he is the best and my starter and I like him. And I like his design, I really do. And I wished that uh, monsters would evolve in this game because Leafy would have potential to look pretty dang cool. Like a grass Charizard. Just saying. If someone ever makes a sequel of this game, I doubt, I highly doubt they'd ever make a sequel of this game. Though I wouldn't say no to that. So where are we? We are somewhere around here in the wild. I just... Mm -hmm. There is... Nothing? Is this really... Is this really just a... A... What's it called? A dead end. Nothing else. I mean, we're gonna fight or raise this one. A Venitale, which we already have. I'm gonna use Dinkum again, because he's on the verge of leveling up. And this Venitale that shakes its... Bottom! <laughs> is no match for us. Although it is quite fast. It probably has a... yeah, probably had... Probably had the advantage on dirt or something. Bam! Gotcha. And I really don't do that much damage to it. Let's use our special and win. With style. And we we'll level up. Level 17. Dinkum again level 17. Everything plus one. So, alright. There are no star pieces around, or at least I didn't see any anything uh, twinkle. So the dead end was just like, yeah, you know... Ha! <laughs> it was just like, yeah, you know, you could have gone there. Was not sure if it moved. Sleek once again, and Dinkum gets speed boost again. Nice. But we're gonna use Leafy anyway. Because, like I said, he he should always be the strongest, the best, and damn, his starting boost that he gets. What was it called? I have no idea. But that's a pretty dang good trade. Also, we get our boost on grass, so the Sleek has no chance at all. Oh, 304 EXP until the next level. That's doable. That's pretty doable. We got a green orb down there. Ooh, and a purple orb down there. Will we get there right now or does it just show us that we could go there someday somehow? Yep, seems to be that way. We somehow need to get down there, which just means we're gonna have to go around somehow. Uh, and there are no minimaps for these uh, regions. The best minimap we have is this. Does that help us? Nope. By the way, are we? We're in Japan, right? Yeah, it's it's Fuji. Oh, the cup was China, right? The Chinese Open or something like that. Because I was pretty convinced that we were in China at the moment. But like I said, I think it was just the cup. The Chinese cup or something like that that brought us to China and now we are in Japan. In the wild. Because Mount Fuji and is not in China, and I think I think I know enough about the world map to know that we are in Japan right now. Interesting. So the last title or the title of the last video could be a bit confusing. Okay, green orb, and there should be the place that we just saw. Yes, or at least one of them. Just just locked. I don't care. Goya. Leafy gonna deal with that Goya pretty quick because I mean we already saw that he does. 
I think it was something like a flying start or something. I don't even care much about the coins, although, since I'm already here, why not? I win and we're done. That's hardly a challenge at the moment, by the way, I'm gonna increase the lightning. Yeah, yeah. Doesn't really do much. If I go like this. Yeah, it's better. Oh, shit. So I don't have any special uh, lighting equipment, just because I don't think it would do much at the moment, and I won't have space for it. Oh, we're already racing. I'm sorry, it's just the cord. It's the cord, the wire, or the whatever. It got stuck a bit, and that sucks. Because I hate it when I'm, when I'm using a controller and the cord gets stuck somewhere, even if I have enough space or enough cord to use it properly, I just hate the feeling to know that there is something. And yeah, my, my lamp is just a normal IKEA lamp that probably everyone has or had. Leaf is level 20 now and only got one for each stat. That kinda sucks, but hey, I'm, I'm okay with that. Who are you? Are you something interesting? No, you're just a sleek. Oh, Whispergriff would have gotten uh, boosts. I should have used him. Oh yeah, I would love to have a better lighting setup. And I'm actually thinking about a green screen when I get a bit more money. Not because I need it, because, I mean, my YouTube channel is small enough to say, yeah, you don't need anything. But then again, if I don't use anything fancy, then why should it get bigger, right? Something like that. A Goya. I'm gonna use Leafy again. Just to make it quick and painless. So yeah, I'm, I'm planning on upping my setup even more. Just because I myself want to have better quality videos and streams. And though people <laughs> don't really watch at the moment, I just... If someone stops by and just finds a video of mine, I want it to have quality. More or less. I hope Jong Yoon is going doing his job and taking care of them. Nope. Renegade's a real pain in the neck. I think I gave her a different voice, but who cares? Blah! What? I knew I couldn't trust that great Galumph. Is Galumph even a word? <laughs> Don't you know when to quit? The money you so generously donated to us is going to Edwin to use for the glory of Astro Force. And there's nothing that you can do about it. Ha 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 ha. Rosalita has challenged me to a monster race. Yeah, let's just defeat her. Though it's a trainer race. So, it's actually until the finish line and not just the moving finish line. But this thing pretty much is no match for me because I am pretty beefed up at the moment. So, I'm jumping around quite a bit. Because going uphill slows us down as well as jumping. But jumping, I think, slows us down less than going uphill. We're just gonna fly like this. Get the meat, get those coins. Get more coins, get the power up. And I think there is no doubt that we are winning. Nope. Should have used my boost to get up there. Or could have used, but didn't have it. Nope, nope. She wants to she wants to get past me with a boost, but she won't because I boost as well. Ooh, skill turbo level 2. No, I can't lose. Still, there is a, is a silver lining. That money you wanted back, Dong Jun has it. Did I forget to mention it? Ha ha ha, bye. I don't really care, it wasn't that much money. So, skills. Yeah, flank start. Turbo level. Increases turbo to level 2. So even if I find a turbo level 1, a pickup, the blue pickup, it... Uh, even if it's only level 1, for me it's like it's level 2. That's pretty nice. So, do we have to get back to where Dong Jun is? Or is it just that we're done here now? I'm not quite sure. By the way, where are we? How do we get out here? Have we been here already? Nope, doesn't seem that way. All. I don't think so. But maybe it just 
respawn. The, the, the chests do respawn, I think. Uh, I can play this game one-handed by just using something to press to the right. In this case, I used my chest. <laughs> so yeah, those wild encounters are pretty easy. The trainer encounters or whatever are a bit more challenging, though at the moment we are pretty dang strong. Uh, yes, it was the... Ah, sorry. It was the Chinese Open. Did we have... Uh, please wait just a little while. No, I want to go to the Chinese Open right now. Um, okay, so we have to find Dong Jun again. And I hope, I just hope he doesn't... Oh, yeah, they were just other people. That's it. I thought they were those two in disguise. Um, so, let's just hope when we get to this guy that he won't just send us back like, no, I don't have the money, she has it. Ha ha ha. That would suck. But somehow I... I wouldn't, uh, how do you say that? I wouldn't put it past this game to do something like that. So, Whisper Griff is a cool monster and all, but since I, he is not trained or don't, doesn't have any advantages on terrain, he is just pretty dang slow. Like, or maybe it's just his, his size that makes him seem slow, but it's not... It's not really fun using him, just because it doesn't do much. Then again, of course, he is 4 level behind Leafy and I didn't train him at all, so... More green orbs. I could give them to Whisper Griff. Because the green Whisper Griff probably looks pretty dang interesting. And we're gonna go jump on his back or attack him from behind, something like that. Get some more coins, since we're already here. And now, this boost gives us boost level 2 because of our trade. Even if it was just boost level 1, for us it was boost level 2, which is nice. Let me throw something up there. Where am I? Where do I have to go? I'm so bad at remembering. Like, I think it was somewhere over here, or is that... No, the, this is the maze. Yeah. This is where we started this episode. So, nope. We're gonna go somewhere else. I just don't know where. Probably up here? Nah. Up there? No, that's, that was... This was actually where we... Yeah, where we started. Because we went all around. Went the other way all around. And then saw those two entrances, which we don't want now. So where's the big fella? I'm so bad at this. <laughs> I don't... Okay, this is... This just gets us outside, right? Yeah, oops. So, to the upper right is where we started this episode. To the left here, there is pretty much nothing. It's not here, not there. And we're back at the beginning, more or less, because down there is the... Would you, would you move, please? Alright, I just, I wanted to avoid this, but... Dang it, I'm gonna breeze right through. And I'm overlooking a path somewhere. I do not remember where I have to go to find Dong Jun. Yeah, I don't care. So up there, up there. Do we have to? Like, seriously? Dang, him with the boost? That's pretty dang strong. And I'm just gonna breeze right through. Excuse me. Can we finish this before we reach the grass? 
Yes, technically. Like, about five pixels. Nice. But up here was where she was, right? Yeah, she was right there. I'm confused. There should be at least one more path that we can go. Like, am, am I stupid? I mean, I know I am, but am I stupid? There's nothing. Down there is the chest and the entrance. Up there is where we had to go. Up here is the merry-go-round, but maybe maybe he is somewhere else now. No, just, why? Okay, maybe. I think, yeah, we defeated him and he ran away, right? So it would make sense that he is somewhere that we have already been? I'm kind of fuzzled. That's like confused, but with a bit more fuzzle. And we're almost level up, well, at least something. At least it's okay for training. So just be on the lookout, maybe we'll see him some. That's why there is a dead end, because later on he stands in a dead end. Go, let me go, let me go. Oh, mama mia, mama mia, mama mia, let me go! And gotcha. This one was on purpose, because I want Leafy to level up before the boss fight. I mean, if we fight him again, he only has his bamboozle. So nothing, nothing special. Let's get some... Let's get some money while we're at it. Because so far we haven't really used the money for uh come on. Oh damn, that's some that's some nice stats. So the only time we actually used money was A because they told us to, and B to get some equipment, but now we have equipment on all three of our monsters. So we don't really need money at the moment. I messed up with the racer metal that time. I gotta make this plan work or they'll think I'm stupid. I'll never be leader. Yeah, you'll never be leader. Nah, not you again. I can't afford it to screw up anymore. Which means you give me no choice. I've been saving this monster for a very special occasion. Is it bamboos again? It's a special exotic bamboos. Oh my god, it looks stupid. Like, I should love it, but. Well, damn, it looks stupid. <laughs> I still kind of love it, but no, uh, damn. Interesting. Have I not played this far? Last time? Because, I mean, I can't really remember that he had an exotic bamboozle. I can't really remember ever seeing an exotic. Other than that one that I couldn't catch. Anyway. Let's see. He doesn't seem to be anything special. We're just gonna go up there, see? And that's how you get... Uh, up the last path. So he has grass double ring or whatever it's called. He has uh, double efficiency on grass. We only have normal efficiency on grass, but like seriously, like with enough speed, we could have gone up there with just a normal jump. But with just using the other thing as a ramp with a boost, you can go up there, no problem. That's that's all a right experience. Every single time. What is wrong with me? Yeah, you just suck. I'm gonna be in big trouble. But there's one saving grace. I don't have the money. Rosalita's got it. See, told you. Bad luck. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I mean, it's my fault. I wanted to play this game. But still, I really like this game. It's it's just fun. It's nothing special, but it's just fun. Easy fun. And once again, just get some money. It's my side job now. If YouTube doesn't work, I'm just gonna monster race. Though if monster racing were a thing, or monster battling, or whatever, something with monsters, then I wouldn't do YouTube. Or maybe, like, imagine Pokemon exist, or Digimon exist, or Monster Hunter style monsters exist, or Monster Racer style. Something with monsters exist. How many YouTube channels would there be? Like, 
if, if you think about it just for a moment, you're, you'd be like, nah, there won't be any YouTube channels because you could live it in real life. But then again, you could live every normal thing, like sports, you could do in real life, but some people tend to do it on the screen. You could cook yourself, but some people prefer watching cooking channels. I kind of like cooking channels every now and then, and I don't like to cook. It's just that some are really, really well made and really funny, really entertain entertaining. So even if there were monsters, and I'm not talking about a dystopian future where everything is destroyed like in um, God Eater or something like that where we have no internet, we have to go outside and hunt. But like, if there are, if there were some monsters, then there would be videos and channels about them, and people wouldn't go outside. Maybe have one like if this, if it's like Pokemon. Maybe you'd have your favorite Pokemon sitting around like a pet, and still watching videos about other people playing or doing stuff with Pokemon. Interesting to think about, in my opinion. But anyway, this is not looking good. That Renegade, I've got to find a way to get out of here. Okay, that voice was just strange. Well, I've got a decent head start. I should be safe for a while. Yeah, if you run into a dead end, then you won't ever be safe. What? You're here already? I, I might, like, if you went, like, through here and hit all the way, like, here, I wouldn't have found you. You lot don't know when to quit. Seems I have to teach you. For the future of Astral Force, for the honor of Nasta Edwin. Simply cannot lose. Not with this monster. Is it a exotic, an exotic form of your normal? Monster, yes, it. Ooh, that looks interesting. Knocks out exotic. Dinkum would have the advantage, but Leafy is just so much stronger in every regard. Yeah, that looks actually pretty cool. Can a monster get exotic if I just change the color? Like, if I change the color enough. Would it count as exotic, or is it just? It, does it have to be uh, naturally exotic for it to be considered exotic? Those are hard-hitting questions. Once again, let's go up there because it just lets you skip a, quite a portion of the map. Can we this time get a turbo before the last part? I think we can because this time we got the meat. Is it? Yes, it's up here. And see, we did it, and <coughs> we went way too far. <laughs> but you've seen that I was actually right, and you can go up there, right? Just, I just didn't do it. I should have used the boost before going uphill. Then maybe, yeah, some, something like that. It's just coins up there, nothing ever, nothing different. No, no! How can you be so good? Yeah, well, I am. But I've got a secret. I don't have your money. Dong Jun's got it. Okay, hold her back and just pummel the shit out of her. Even if she's a woman, she's deser she deserves it in that case. Just pummel them both. Get him as well and just hit the everlasting crap out of them. Everloving? Everlasting? Something like that. Don't know. Not that fluent in English. <laughs> so, is he somewhere like this again? I don't think he is, but I'll just... Oh, I'll just take a look to be on the safe side. But he's probably... Okay, so he isn't up there. Is he down here? Nope, nope. Oh, they're both here. Nice. We're finally safe. There's no way they'll find us here. Hmm. I'm sorry, but... It was... J I, I skipped our dialogue because it's just the usual. We are so great. Our master will be great. It's just Team Rocket. Not again. You know, I'm really starting to dislike you people. Well, that makes us even. That's it then, isn't it? Clearly we can't get rid of you, racing one at a time. What about both of us at once? That, why would that be any different? Like, okay, they both can use different turbos and stuff, but if I beat them fair and square in a race, both of them, then I will beat both of them at once. If it were a fight, that would be different. But anyway, this game is about racing, so of course they do it like this. But after this, I got them both right next to me. I'm gonna demand my money back, or... I don't care even if they gave it away already. I don't care. I just want them, or their arc, 
at the moment to be over. So, oh, <laughs> that was too fast. It was like right here. But like I said, I don't really care. I'm still with messing up that much, like jumping, wrong jump, uh, running straight into a wall. I, I don't even have time to spare. Two seconds on Rosalita and two seconds and some more on Dong Jun. No problem at all. We lost! Hecken! But we ganged up on them on the, and everything. And this would have really impressed Edwin. And I would have been promoted. Nope. This is all your fault. We'll get you back. You wait. Okay. Oh, there's a star piece right in front of us. Or is that just our money? It's just our money. <laughs> Look at this. It's your money. The money they stole. They must have dropped it. Of course they did. I'm so glad we got that back. It's so much money. Who did they say they were? Astral Force? That's a silly name. We'd better watch out for them. Okay, let's head back and win that Chinese Open. Alright, so they were nice enough to wait for us. Do we have a ladder to get out of here? Ooh, can be sold at a shop for a high price. Don't know why I have that. Rope ladder. We have two of them, so we're gonna use one. I just don't want to walk back. Um, Chinese Open, we got like five minutes left on this episode, more or less, so yeah. Is that clear? Yes, sir, crystal clear, sir. So he's the, he's the boss. Mm. How scary is he? He was bossing those guys around. Who on earth is he? So let's just, yeah, let's just go and win this. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Chinese Open. Are you ready to race? I said, are you ready to race? So much is on the line. Fame, glory, riches, honor, and entry into this year's Asian Grand Prix. Who among those these mighty racers will lay claim to these prizes? We are only moments away from the start of the tournament. Oops. Participants, please proceed to the gate, uh, race gate. We, we can't, can't lose. Our, our, our master Edwin Hill. Yeah, you will, you will lose, no problem. Are you ready to enter the Chinese Open? Of course. Like, I have my Leafy, he gets a boost, but I'm just gonna breeze through with Leafy. We got the qualifying, we just need to beat one minute, which shouldn't be a problem. Three, two, one, go. Okay, that was all right. Okay, we're on sand now, which, does it make us gradually slo uh, slower? So we got sand and we got stone. No, it just feels that way. So we're pretty much not suited. Whoa, for sand. Holy. This could be harder than I thought it would be. But I don't have anyone who's good on sand and train. So I'm gonna stick with leafy. So I'm a bit faster on stone than I am on sand, it's 2 miles per hour, which kind of can make a difference. And we're done. 48 seconds, so it's not that hard. And we're leveled up. Nice. And that, ladies and gentlemen, concludes the qualifying. And what a fantastic array of races we have before us. Can you feel the tension here? Nope. The semifinals are our next stop and this excitement train. Who would possibly be <laughs> Who would possibly guess who the winner will be? Who could possibly guess? Okay. Got it now. Sorry. <laughs> Chinese Open semifinal. Who do we have? Pixis, Ina and Feng Yi. With a Sleek, a Venetail and a Gia Goya. Well, that was foreseeable to say the least. Probably someone in the final or quarterfinal or no, there's no quarterfinal, semifinal is, yeah, sorry. I get confused with the English terms. So um, in the finals someone probably will have a Whisper Griff, one or two people will have special monsters, like a Bamboozle, and someone will have a monster that we haven't seen yet, I would guess. Like, it would make the most sense to me. And by the way, we're 
actually pretty we're doing pretty good like those right behind us are not really right behind us and breeze through to the finish line oh even better than the qualifying wow i did really good like five seconds to the second one six seconds to the third one and the fourth one didn't even finish before i pressed a Magnifico! The semifinals are over! Our finalists have been decided, but one name stands out! Something! <laughs> the new star, Renegade! After a victory down in Oshnia, the momentum hasn't let up, but will that form be carried over into the final? We will soon know! Hold on to your heads, everyone! <gasps> okay. Let's let's check out the rivals first head. Really? I mean, okay, all of them are good on sand, but... Really? Two Goya and a Whispergriff? That, that's all? That's all? Well, it's really, really unfortunate. Like, that's a that's a huge letdown. Way Hydra and Feng Yi again. Feng Yi. Wasn't he the one who got last in, last in the last race? I don't know. Three, two, one, go. Yeah, that was pretty much a perfect start. I'm pretty slow here, but like I said, on stone I'm better. And they are right behind me. This time they're actually behind me. But still, until they got their turbo, I don't think there will be any problem. Ooh, and once again, I fucked up. But that's why I got a boost. Which they have too. And I gotta watch out because some, I don't know about the enemies right now, but some monsters can shoot stuff when they use their boost. But it doesn't seem to be that way, uh, the, the case right now. Because sometimes they're just from behind and you don't even see it coming. There comes something. You get hit. 48 seconds, zero. What's the card? Milliseconds? Something like that, yeah. So, I get better every time. <coughs> Whoa, that was quite a lot of EXP. Level 23, speed plus 2, nice. So Leafy is freaking strong. And the winner of this year's Chinese Open is Renegade! What a wonderful performance! Please come forward to collect the winner's trophy! I got a cough in my throat, wait! <coughs> okay, all better. I got the Chinese Open trophy, nice. And with this splendid victory comes a chance for more glory at the Asian Grand Prix! A terrific showdown against one of the stars 7 awaits you. One more time everyone, thunderous applause, por favor! Or is it per favore? <laughs> I lost! What am I going to say to Master Edwin? Is Edwin one of the star 7? Like, seriously? I don't know. But with that... 32 minutes, 33 minutes, yeah, with that we're gonna save... Ended with a bang with winning the Chinese Open. Thank you guys for watching. I'm the Renegade, Cactus and I gotta run. Bye bye!